This is a Wii tutorial to show you how to find the domain names that have or do not have SSL certificates. So we'll take Plumber, Miami, Florida, in local biz, and search. Okay, it's found 124 companies. We'll go to Dig Deep. You need to use the Dig Deep if you want to get as much information about the companies as possible, and Dig Deep is typically where email addresses are located. See, at the moment there are 11, and you can change the criteria in search settings if you wish. You would click on Stop Dig Deep and click on LFJ Standard or whatever this button reads and change the criteria. So I'm going to pause the video while Dig Deep is running. You can always look down this left column and see the search progress. When these are all at 100%, then Dig Deep is complete. From your search screen, it's a good idea to go to Email. We'll click on Library, and here are a couple dozen pre-made email, and you can highlight ones that you want to use and click on Download. Okay, and let's go. So we highlight the one that we want to edit and click on Modify. I always set the max width at about 400. Totally up to you what you want to use. And I would read through this whole message and check the wording, make sure it's what you want it to read. And uh, you can change tokens if you want. The tokens are on the right hand side here and let's come through and wherever there's like an arrow and dash lines you're going to remove that so I'll put the hyperlink in here so the URL will be to your website and you put whatever text you want in here and so when somebody receives the email they'll click on this link and it will take them to your SSL website and then here are dash lines and so just highlight it and remove it and put your name you can put your phone number now if you hit the enter key it will space two spaces if you hold down the shift key and hit enter it advances one space only and then put your website in here and once you're happy with your message you're going to save and send a test email. Email has been sent. Okay here is the test email in my Gmail inbox and the formatting looks good the information is correct and here is the link that will take someone to my SSL website. So here's my SSL website. So I know that this is all properly set up. The email was correct. And we'll go back to Lead Finder Jack. And if you want to write more than one email, you can do so. Just click on Create and enter all the information that you want. Use the tokens that you want to use set your max width, add your subject line, and give it a name and save it. Okay, now we will go to campaigns. Here are the results of the most recently run search and this is for finding the SSL. So you come over to the right hand side here and scroll down this the column until you get to URL and if you want to use only only results that have a URL because if there isn't a domain then there's nothing to put an SSL on so you'll select yes you need a URL so I've selected all of the results that have a URL and then I come over to the right sidebar come to secure URL and from the drop down select HTTP and click on email and here is the SSL email so you highlight 
the email that you want to use in the right column, click on the little arrows and move the email over to the left column. So now this email is now connected with this campaign and click OK. Now you'll select whether you want to select all email. So you see all of the email that are not highlighted in yellow. The addresses are all selected. You can deselect all email and auto select. If you auto select, it will pick just the first email address from any group of email addresses. And these all domains that are not secured with an SSL certificate. Now I'll send a test email and it will select an address from the list and it reads start campaign. All it's going to do is send one email to my email address. Test email has been sent. Click OK. Okay, so here is the test email sent to my inbox and it shows the company name that it was going to. And everything is copacetic and we are ready to go. So we go back to Lead Finder Jack and click on Start Campaign. And that wraps up this tutorial.